I'm saved, I'm healed, I'm free, I'm delivered by your name, I'm saved, I'm healed, I'm free, I'm delivered by your name. Two weeks ago, on the 12th of March 2022, during our local and international one-on-one -on -one visitors program, this woman, coming for the first time to Charis Missionary Church, was opportune to see Prophet Andres Simono, amongst many other things, for a breakthrough in her newly formed business that was not doing well. Upon her deliverance, Prophet Andres revealed a spirit of lust in her, which was capable of attacking men and pastors by just eye contact. Let us watch her deliverance and testimony and be edified in our faith. The dirty spirit. The dirty spirit. What are you doing here? Huh? What are you doing here? Huh? So you're modeling now. <coughs> So you're modeling. Yeah? You're modeling. So you're modeling behind me. Yeah? Fire! That's coming. That is attacking men. This one. The spirit. The spirit of lust. That attacks men. Uh, this lady, she's got a spirit of lust. If she look at you like this, you are finished. I'm telling you. Out! Pastors also. Sarah, look, look what she's doing. Out in the name of Jesus. Come on, you demon. So, what, what are you doing there? Huh? What are you doing there? Look, look how he's looking at you. What are you doing there? <laughs> what are you doing there? Eh? What are you doing there? Huh? What are you doing here? Out in the name of Jesus. Come on! Come on, you evil spirit! Come on, you evil spirit! Come on! Today you had an opportunity of seeing Prophet Andres one on one. I want you to take us through your experience and tell us what happened when you saw him. And I'd love that you also please confirm the prophecies that you received today? Uh, when I saw a prophet, I was 
afraid they was shy but yeah he, he prophets he prophet about my spiritual husband my business yeah the things that I'm eating and when I'm sleeping like he told almost everything and those things I, I know them he spoke about my business yes that I am I, like I'm planning, I'm planning to quit, yeah, to get a job. So, but I'm confused. I don't know what to do. To leave a business or to continue with a job. To, to continue if I'm looking for some job. Yes. What are some of these challenges that you were experiencing in your business? Like I, I lose people. Eventually, I, it's not it's my business. Is, is, is new so I don't get clients that much or the way I'm expecting so even when they come they come once and go I don't know they don't come and beg yes. both her and her husband came back on the 20th of March 2022 two weeks later to thank and glorify God for her business breakthrough and their new car a Mitsubishi Expander. We give glory to God. Amen. I greet you all in the name of Jesus. Two weeks back, Bendila is on to go one on one. Two weeks ago, I was here in church coming for one on one. Bengala no Guza. It was my first time to be here. That Dibana no Prophet Simono. I met Prophet Simono. Wang Tandazela on a total deliverance. He prayed for me and delivered me. I was speaking more about my business that it was not prospering. So I was prayed for so that my business can prosper. Now as I'm speaking, my business is going on in a fruitful way. And even though it's like that, so my husband was having a problem when we come to the things of jobs. He would hike. And he will apply for loans and he will never get money from banks. Everything was closed. After, eh? After I came here, everything opened and now he bought his car. I just want to thank the God of Charis. Because the life I was living before is no longer the same as the life I'm living now. I really want to thank God. And he is saying, when my wife was, what my wife was speaking is really the truth, because the way I was moving from where I stay to go to my workplace, I have to wake up early in the morning and I used to hike. So I want to thank the power of the Lord. So here was place and was was seven So and now they want to thank the Lord for what God has blessed them with. But the name of the car is Mitsubishi Expander. Hey. Hey, God Almighty. They say, she is saying, when you are far away, it's white, but when you are closer, it turns like it wants to be gray. We really thank God. I want to thank the God of Charis. It was very difficult in my own life before I came to this place. God has changed a lot of things in, my, in our lives. We really want to thank the Lord because of Charis Missionary Church. 
Abantu abasa doubting about Charis Missionary Church. People are still doubting about Charis Missionary Church. Bengtanda uguti kuni. I want to say to them. I'm your example. Amen. Amen.